Stream the new Adopt Me single, Dance With Me, available now on all digital platforms. Jesse here with no news, no videos, just a lovely message to end the year. We're on holiday right now, the whole studio is taking a well-earned break ready for the new year. We'll be back next week with our first update of 2022. January 5th will be our first update video of 2022, I'm looking forward to it. But I thought I would take this chance to jump back into the YouTube channel and talk about you. See, we've put out loads of updates this year, expanded our little team of developers, launched a company, Uplift Games, you might have heard of it, and grown a lot as a game and as a team. So this is me, Jesse, as the face of Adopt Me on YouTube, but also as a person who's had an amazing time working on this game saying thank you. If you played Adopt Me at all this year, you're an important part of our story. And even more to me, if you spent your time watching these YouTube videos, leaving nice comments, if you've shared the trailer we made with your friends, you're the reason I wake up every day excited to do this job. And it's not just me, but our developers, our whole team, sees your nice comments, your videos, your pictures, whether it's on TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, or in the Discord, we're thankful to have such an amazing community of people to make this game for, and we can't wait to come back next year and show you what we've all been working on. I think it's gonna be amazing. Since I'm recording this before I go on holiday, there's no YouTube videos. Instead, I wanna spend some extra time with our community showing off as much amazing fan art as I can. Remember, you can join in on this too. All you need to do is join discord.gg slash adopt me get to level 5 and start submitting your fan art and you could be featured in a future video. First up, we have Aria XD, who has consistently provided wonderful art to the Discord over the past year, sharing their vision of a Krampus in-game. New to the channel is Capybara, with this incredibly realistic shadow dragon. We've got two here from Chaotic Crystals. First is a concept for a fox pet, and second is an idea of what a hippo would look like in Adopt Me. I can't end the year without at least one image from Dusk, who always gives us the best stuff, and who rumours suggest is actually a small burb themselves. Could this be a self-portrait? Elvelin77 shared the most Instagram-ready parrot I've ever seen. GBD debuts with this chaotic duo of a neon evil dachshund riding a neon bee. I'm Mr. Renzo returns with a fantastic redraw of their Christmas fan art from last year. Comey Leaf is here to sketch out a neon frost dragon from memory and did an amazing job. Last year's Hunter has been another staple of the fan art channel and today I'm sharing an incredible raccoon concept and this pink cat appreciation because pink cats deserve love and respect too. Speaking of raccoon concepts, Lily Hollick shared an update of their raccoon concept with a bonus top hat. It's not just drawings, we've had a plethora of 3D art this year and we're capping that off with this clay evil unicorn from Newbies. Ocean 80 shares a trade between a gold walrus and a bat dragon. Paint Coffee is blasting onto our fan art scene with these unbelievably good shadow dragons and show some love for the St. Bernard from just a few days ago. Shuko Nishmiya sent us this fantastic wide-eyed bat dragon. And finally, closing out an amazing 2021 has to be Xander, with a pet I would love to see join Adopt Me one day, the Moth. That's it for this year. We'll be back with our first update video of the year on the 5th of January, and I'll be back on New Year's Eve for one last video this year. I hope you enjoy it and if you haven't already, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss an Adopt Me video. See you next year.